This documentary tells the story of Peggy Guggenheim. From a banking family in New York, she inherited a modest fortune and she started to spend that money in the 1920s and 30s on modern art at a time when it was absolutely not appreciated. She helped to uh, start the careers and had relationships with, sometimes as a patron, sometimes as a lover, Max Ernst, Marcel Duchamp, Salvador Dali, Picasso. She knew Ezra Pound. She knew uh, Samuel Beckett and was his lover. This is an extraordinary life. It starts in New York, then she goes to Paris. She managed to smuggle out incredibly important works of modern art out of Paris as the Nazis marched on France. And then it ends in Venice with her building this tremendous collection that is still available for the general public to see. She made these people into cultural superstars from almost nothing, but at the same time, her personal life was a bit of a car crash. And it's this uh, sort of twofold story of personal tragedy, tragedy and career success that makes her a really interesting character.